My name is Nigel Reeves. I run a company called The Wolf Within. Uh, the website's www.thewolfwithin.co.uk. And what I do is I teach young people how to train badly behaved dogs. And what I'm doing with that is I'm showing them what an idea of a social hierarchy should be. So if these young people have had a bad upbringing, I'm showing them what it could be, what you should be, and how to do that. You give them kinesthetic experience on exactly how to do that over and over again. So when these young people learn how to be this leader, and what qualities is a good leader, it's calm, it's convincing, it's consistent. So when these young people learn these, these qualities of how to be a good leader, and show it to dogs, and then get results, they realize that these skills can be transferred in all parts of their life. So I teach young people this, rebellious young kids this, because I believe that all kids have not been given the, the perfect childhood. And these gaps have to be filled in. Obviously they don't get filled in with schools, um, so emotional intelligence, or linguistic intelligence, or whatever, spiritual intelligence, there has to be a place for this in society. And we have to know, we have to work on that. But when the lady was speaking, actually both ladies, in fact all of them, the speaker was just amazing, they absolutely blew me away with what they were saying. And what they're trying to do is appeal to a, an audience of people which school kind of rejects. So school, um, they encourage academics, they reward academics. And it's the emotional brilliance in life the young people that they're talking about, the, one, the ones that are really important in life to, to fit into society, benefit. So if you're academically brilliant, I get it. But for example, if you take a wolf pack or you take an elephant pack, we all need different forms in these packs for the pack to survive. Every one of them is needed. So when we reward academics by saying, you're great, so a, a, child, a child goes to school and he does brilliant in maths, he does brilliant in physics, and all of a sudden he gets this amazing sense of self-respect, just everyone saying, oh, you're great, you're great. These emotional people, these people that have a purpose on this earth, are constantly getting rejected for doing what they're actually great at, and they're actually, they're so needed in society today, and that's exactly what these people were trying to get forward today, and I got that, definitely. It's really nice to come to a place like this, and, and I know there's like-minded people like myself out there who all come in one room and get together and get your ideas formulated. And you know, I've, I've, come along, I've come away with a lot of it and uh, yeah, I'm going to rave on this place. It's really good. Thank you. <laughs>